Hey everyone, Coach Arrow here. On this episode of Behind the Play, we're gonna look at a critical hack by Doha in map five of the Battle for Texas. The outlaws are in such a good spot. Now just back out and approach this any way you want to. The fuel get their control, but now they are at death's door, Jake. One more lost fight, and the outlaws are the victors. Dante's EMP, though, is going to be the crucial piece here. To set up this play, the second point of Oasis, we're down 99 to 0. We've just captured the point, and we have to capture 0 to 100% all in one stretch. We can't lose the point. With this being our first fight, it's actually pretty crucial to note that Houston Outlaws has five ultimates coming online to our three. The most important one being Dante's EMP, but we don't have any support ultimates to counter this EMP. This is the most crucial part of this whole map because EMP is one of those ultimates that can completely team wipe an enemy team if they don't have the ability to counter it with some kind of ultimate. The ultimates that we have aren't that great for countering EMP. Our preferred ultimate would be our Lucio or Brigida ult to be able to use as a counter to Dante's EMP. Knowing that we don't have support ultimates to counter Dante's EMP, we know that we have two options. We need to pick one. So either A, we need to find and eliminate Dante before he can use his EMP, or we need to find some way to counter it, uh, which generally is pretty hard to do when you don't have ultimates to be able to counter it. As Houston's pushing onto the point to contest the objective, Doha sets up behind in stealth and patiently waits for Dante to unstealth. You are doing a great job hiding as well, though. And now you look just in between the two Sulfras. Fuel dancing on the edge. You can't look over it. Dante hacked and down. Doha all over those not EMP. But he does drop the EMP right after. Dante's goal is to pressure our tanks and force them to contest the point. When they come to point, he's gonna EMP, and then they're gonna try to push off that EMP. As soon as Dante unstealths though, Doha is already in position, and he finds a hack onto Dante, making him unable to EMP. Doha calls out that he's gotten his hack, and so we push super aggressive and eliminate Dante before he can use his EMP. This play is extremely important because now that Dante has been eliminated, we're able to win this fight and now build our support ultimates so that next fight when Dante uses the MP, we have the ability to counter it with our support ultimates. It was off the back of this hack play that we were able to flip the momentum into our favor and snowball it into a victory.